let's talk about the difference between being in victimhood and being victimized because I think sometimes they get mixed up and they get mixed up for a good reason because if we've had any experience of being victimized in any way where we are the victim of something then we can carry victimhood naturally and we can carry it into other areas of our lives. Now this is normally addressed when we bring healing to the area or the incident in which we were victimized. However, there's also a natural inclination in which we call on the drama triangle victimhood. And victimhood is where we go through life positioning ourselves as the victim. We do it for multiple reasons. One is not to take responsibility, one is to be saved, one is because sometimes it's safer depending on our previous experiences, one is because it's easier to to take the position of victimhood than it is to take the position of responsibility. So victimhood is where I look at everything through the lens of how am I the victim here? And I position myself naturally, unconsciously into the position of victim. So even if a situation hasn't really victimized me, I find a way to become the victim of the situation. Now, and I say this, it is not unusual if we have been victimized to find ourselves doing that. So please don't shame yourself if that's occurring. I would suggest seeking some support, doing some personal development, doing some coaching around it. Um, However, there's also in that drama triangle, all of us, anybody can fall into victimhood positions. And it's really, really um, important to understand. I said victimhood and I meant to say victim. Yeah, no, that's what I meant to say. Anyway, so we can fall into that victimhood position and it can start to shape our lives like we're the victim, but it also disempowers us and might have us very, very stuck as we look around and give out about everybody not being who we think they should be or the way we think they should be. So there is a difference between being the victim of a crime or of an experience that we shouldn't have experienced that actually we are completely victimized within. That is very different to looking through the lens of victimhood at our lives and finding ways that people have taken from us when actually we haven't taken responsibility for ourselves and it's really important that we differentiate between the two. So there is a difference between being victimized and being a victim of an incident or a crime versus looking at life through the lens of victimhood which is what the drama triangle primarily speaks about. So if you'd like to know more about the dry and triangle, you can find it on my blog, on my website, www.sheilawalsh.com. I hope that was helpful.